Saat kendaraan lain berdesakan di jalanan Nairobi sembari menyemburkan asap hitam, Benjamin Maina mengemudikan bis unik yang sepenuhnya memakai mesin listrik. I feel privileged um, driving this vehicle. It's also very amazing um, uh, when you are driving this vehicle compared to the fossil fuels uh, vehicles. Um, considering there is a lot of uh, vibrations uh, on fossil fuel vehicles and also a lot of noise. Uh, but with this vehicle, it's quite silent uh, and very slick. Transportasi umum di Kenya dan di seluruh benua Afrika sebagian besar dijalankan secara informal dan tanpa standar emisi, memakai banyak kendaraan yang sangat berpolusi. If you look at uh, the cities, the heavy-duty vehicles, which are buses and trucks, that's the bulk of the pollution, you know. Um, so they are a big contributor to pollution. But as I said, they are also an opportunity, because how do we shift to cleaner modes How do we shift? Because we need mass transport to be sustainable, to make cities more sustainable. Opibas memperkenalkan bis listrik ke pasar Afrika untuk memperbaiki situasi ini. This electric bus is a really important first step in the transition from fossil fuel vehicles to electric clean mobility, right? And I think we really show precedence uh, being the first movers in this market with a bus that's even locally developed. The ride today is one of its own, having ridden on an electric vehicle. It's just cool, no noises like uh, the combustion engines. There are no smells like uh, the combustion engine. So it's just cool and awesome to be in these vehicles. Pasar mobil listrik Afrika masih dalam tahap awal, sehingga memiliki peluang besar bagi investasi dan penciptaan lapangan kerja ramah lingkungan menurut para ahli. When you look at uh, our source of electricity, it is renewable. You know, uh, for example in, in, in Ethiopia, it's almost 100% renewable energy, hydro and, and such. If you look at Kenya, it's over 90, 90-something percent. So we have the energy, you know, uh, we don't have to import fossil fuels, petrol, diesel and all that. So we have the energy here. Then this is also a very good opportunity for jobs, green jobs. Saat polusi dan emisi iklim dari transportasi meningkat, maka semakin tinggi desakan untuk transisi ke mobilitas yang berkelanjutan. Dan ini membawa manfaat bagi warga yang beralih ke kendaraan listrik yang ramah lingkungan. Dari Arlington, Virginia, saya Helmi Johannes dan tim VOA.